uh, barrier. And you know what? Maybe, maybe it is too easy for you. And then you can go play a harder game. But until you're doing that shit, fuck off. Okay? <laughs> fuck, you know, fuck, most fuck people shit who get those times are really good with like one or two weapons. And then all you have to do is play a different weapon and watch it take you 10 minutes. There you go. Guess what? Game's hard. You tried gun locks yet? <laughs> Probably not. Game's hard now. Good job. You did it. Fucking idiot. And that's dumb the fucking, great thing dumb, about dumb. Monster Hunter. It's really just the fighting game. It's like, oh, you know what? Like, I've learned everything there is to know about this character. I know all the matchups. I know all the frame data. I know all that. And now play a different character. And, yep. you and you're always going to have your main. And when it yep. gets hard, you bring your main out. But... You can just pick up some new shit, and the game is is interesting and and strange and hard yep. again, right? So fucking, I don't know, man. People are and just that, so like, dumb. And that's one of the things that like, uh, fighting game is like everybody. You always have, or most people always have like a pocket character, right? Like, okay, this matchup isn't it, but it's fine. I got a pocket, whatever. I can pull out this mm-hmm. character to at least trade off or some would alleviate this terrible matchup for my main. I don't hear that that often in monster hunter. I mean, it's a PVE game, so you don't like need a pocket, but I do wish it was kind of a, a, a more common thing, right? Like most people know me charge blades, like my thing, but long sword and sword and shield are always pocket. And now in rise, like hammers getting up there too, for like pocket weapons. And like, that's always been right. a thing in all monster hunters. Like, even ever since charge blade was a thing long sword's always been my pocket and when long sword was a thing like great sword was like my pocket weapon so it's like i think it's always nice to have that for both sides one for a matchup that might not feel good and two if you're just feeling like everything you fight is just getting demolished because it's your main and you know everything about it switch it up Try you weapon. know when i made that magnamalo video when i said fuck demo magnamalo there were a few people in the comments that said, there is no such thing as, there is no matchup. There is no sword and shield matchup. What are you talking about? Oh my God. And I'm like, do you play this game? <laughs> do you play this? Dude, it's so dumb. There are matchups from literally fucking day one. They bring IG to a Kulu and tell me that it isn't a bad match. Right? That, that, that's, that's really fucking ass, annoying like dude, you just hearing it orange annoys buff, me I, right you can't get orange buff because the orange buff comes from the rock that's pretty yeah, dumb right oh. but like so so when i'm fighting <laughs> so dumb yeah it's pretty silly when i'm fighting a cool loot i bring horn i don't bring ig because it's a bad matchup that's a whole fundamental like it, does Dang your kind of match up does your kin set kiss the rock to get the the nutrients out yeah of it that's a little buff? bit of a <laughs> the rock and then you can break the rock as well. It's pretty, yeah. It's, it's a shitty matchup, right? And pretty much every small monster. That's like, you know, I'm talking like Great Baggy is a pretty bad matchup for IG because it's so tight to get extract. Uh, everything is pretty like if it's small, it's pretty hard to fight with an IG. If it's small, it's pretty easy to fight with a horn because you're gonna KO all the time because the head is like always in your radius, right? Yeah. A good matchup for horn. It's a bad matchup for IG. So I sub horn. And if I don't feel like playing IG on a small monster, I just bring horn, right? Yeah. Like, it's matchups are so apparent in MH. The, the issue is that there are some weapons that work well on everything. So if you're if you're a longsword main, I mean you don't need to worry about matchups. But that's the same with fighting games as well, yeah. right? Like Shaheen in Tekken is good against everyone. He's not great against everyone, but he's good against everyone. You don't need a sub. But, like, someone like Kazia really struggles against lore, right? So you might bring, like, a keep-out focus character if someone instead a lore. It's the same shit, dude. Just because you play longsword doesn't mean that matchups are fixed. Yeah, exactly. 